stupid. What, what is that film? Three Six Five. 300... Oh yeah, okay. Oh yeah. So I was, I was singing. I was singing this song before before uh, we went on air, and uh, basically it's it's from a film called uh, Three Hundred and Sixty Five Days. Right now, I haven't actually seen the film, um, but a girl told me about it a while ago, and I watched the trailer for it. Right, and basically. The, the the premise of the, it's kind of like a Fifty Shades of Grey type film but essentially the premise of the film is there's a guy I think I don't want to get this wrong but roughly it's like a guy uh, kidnaps a girl and he's like uh, I'm going to keep you hostage for a year and I'm going to like ma- ask you to marry me and if by the end of the year you still don't want to marry me and you still don't love me then I'll fucking let you go basically and he's like some rich billionaire guy is this a horror film no it's like one of these chick films where it's like you know no swear to god the guy's like some rich billionaire like super like has yachts and jets and shit and he's like he takes this girl and he's she's obviously she's an above like above age girl but as in like he kidnaps this 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 chick and he's like i i fucking love you and want to have you and she's like no and then he's like right well i'm just going to keep you for a year and then uh what in a room no not in a room but as in he, he just kind of keeps her hostage and like in his life when was this made like a, it was a big thing on Netflix. I think it's like a year ago because a, se- a, a sequel came out and apparently it was shit. Uh, and to be fair, I haven't heard great things about the first one. But it's literally you look at the film and it's just it's just rough fucking like the whole film. Yeah, there's a whole I found a scene and it's like they're on this boat and he's just like fucking and that's where the song's from. Um, do it again. I see red, red, oh red. She's so like, this woman's been kidnapped and raped. <laughs> she's not being raped. She's actually enjoying the sex. Like that. She's not She's she she can't escape. She's like maybe if I fuck the guy, he <laughs> yeah. will leave me alone for a bit or let me go. Yeah, but it's one of these weird things where it's like you don't know what the like liberal stand on it is because you don't want to be like well eventually it's like well she's decided she's made her own choices. She likes him and she's enjoying the sex now. But it's like yeah, but also he's kidnapped her, so they, that's not really alright. Yeah, right. no, there's no there's, if the liberal if the liberal stand ain't that's gross. Yeah, exactly. I don't want to be considered a liberal. <laughs> exactly. Because that's the most that's fucks. Yeah. It, it's, it's a really creepy premise but apparently like girls are like oh my god he's so because they, they get like a really hot guy like the guy's super hot oh that's fine and he's if like it, well, and he's it, like ripped and he's a billionaire and it's like guy, if the guy was fat and gross that'd be such a different well film. of course yeah of course it would i'm gonna keep you and you're gonna marry me yeah. and he's like i don't want to well i'm gonna keep you for a year and if you still don't then i'll let you go <laughs> it's terrible you're just like a fat persian dude with a fucking necklace yeah yeah just smelling like it's, the babs and it's not that guy at all no. um and uh yeah and then they end up like fucking a lot and then i, I, I don't actually know how the film ends because i haven't seen it so i don't actually know how the film ends maybe she we ends up do a movie night yeah i don't really want to watch it though it's gonna be shit i reckon we could get some enjoyment out of it we probably get some content out of it yeah but like you're just sitting there like with a boner <laughs> do you know what I mean? there's nothing better than sitting with a boner with your mate yeah. i think there is something better like sitting with a boner with a girl for example is better than sitting with your mate with a boner because no, it's like a bonding session isn't it? you know you're with your ba- your pal you're both you're both getting turned on by the same thing you both look at each other and wink that just seems mildly homoerotic well i don't know, see how it goes I, I don't really want to see how that goes. Well, I don't mate, want to see how every you story... You ain't got a choice. You ain't leaving until you fuck me. Right, okay, cool. <laughs> nice. Are you the billionaire <laughs> yeah. that I've heard about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Are you the, you made your money in your Red Bull empire? Oh, man. I, would, I, I kind of hope they sponsor me. Hey, if you like that video, we have a ton more. So check out our channel. Find any of the videos that you might like there. We've got a lot more things to watch. So watch them if you like watching stuff. Do you have anything you want to add? Or? Uh, go f*** yourself, Ollie. Ah. Uh, No. (laughs) Watch our videos. Thanks for watching. We have more of them. (laughs) 